Hi you guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome to another what's in my bag video. These are always my most requested videos. I think it's just unanimously all of our favorite types of videos. So I really wanted to show you this beauty. Isn't she so cute? This is a purse I got for Christmas as a gift from my sister-in-law. And as you can see, it's like me in purse form. <laughs> it's from, I think it was from Target. And I love that it has this retro shape. It's almost like a like a train case or something, I wanna say. It's very vintage in the shape and it's just so adorable. It has a really long strap. So even though I am six feet tall, I could even wear this crossbody. It's adjustable, so perfect. So it has gold hardware. Cause you can see this clip I put on is rose gold. So there's like a slight difference there, but super, super, super cute. And I built it a little shrine right here so we can look at it while <laughs> I film. So before we open it up, let me show you this. I just got this at Bath & Body Works. Hopefully they still have it. I will link this and everything else in the description box. But it's like a little pink furry porcupine, I guess. Look at its little face. <laughs> and it has a hand sanitizer inside. So I love having a poof that's also functional. I know that's like kind of weird, but <laughs> hand sanitizer squirts out of this little guy's but I don't know. <laughs> but I love having my hand sanitizer handy and I love that it just looks like a cute little pink purse puff. He has this little face and he's really cute. So then the purse just has this really simple little latch and I love how it opens up with this structured shape. You can see the inside. It says everything I have in here. And I really want to show you guys this purse because most of my <laughs> what's in my bag videos are on like big purses because I like big purses and I cannot lie like I bring a lot of stuff everywhere I go but when we are just going out for the evening like tonight we're just going to an event and probably like a bar or restaurant with some friends this is what I would bring for that kind of <laughs> outing like I'm somewhat sane I know I don't always need to have everything in the kitchen sink so when I do pare it down this is what I bring Obviously I have my phone, I just did a video on this. I have the iPhone 6 Plus. It's old and it's big and I love it. So then in here, I like to compartmentalize what's in my purse. I always keep it in containers. And my favorite purse organizer that I have is Glossier pouches. I show this in every what's in my bag video. I always use these adorable pink pouches that you get from Glossier, which is a skincare and makeup brand if you guys aren't familiar and everything you order from them comes in one of these pouches for free. I think this is the smallest size pouch that they have. I'm pretty sure I have all of the pouches because I buy a ton of their skincare and makeup and stuff. Um, so I have all the different sizes and this is my smallest one. So it's perfect. It fits like perfectly in this purse or a similar size purse. So I love that for just bringing, as it says, necessities because yes, I label my purse. I label my life. <laughs> And so everything in here is just little stuff I would hate to not have if I needed it. So even when I do pare down for a night out, I still bring a lot of stuff. Like for instance, this Tide pin, which is totally rubbed off, but it's perfect for knocking out a stain right away. You never know when you're gonna need that. I have a little pouch of breath mints and gum. I also have a little pouch of Advil and some motion sickness medication because I sometimes get really car sick in LA traffic and it's such a bummer. Then I have this. Okay, so this is actually an even smaller size of the Glossier pouch. Look at that. Ah, it's adorable. This is their little mirror I showed you before. It's just got the prettiest light pink and it has the Glossier logo. And then on this side it says, you look good. So every time you check your lipstick, it's like a little a self esteem boost. And I just really like that it's in its own little pouch. I would have pouches and pouches and pouches in my purse if I could because it just, it's like so much more tidy when you don't have to jumble through everything. I have a hairband because I genuinely hate to need a hairband and not have one. Ugh, so frustrating. I also have a hairbrush. This is so embarrassing. Like it's like a faded Hello Kitty little travel brush. I'm not gonna open it up because I can see the hairs hanging out of it. I probably need a new travel brush, that's awful. This little bundle is like my power bundle. So I have this portable charger, it's by Fuel Rod. I really like that brand because they have like basically vending machines around where you can swap out your dead batteries for a fully charged battery free of charge once you purchase it. And then I just have bundled with it a little iPhone charger and an Apple Watch charger because I have been really working hard to track my activity on my Apple Watch and I'm kind of scared 
it'll die sometime when I'm out and about and I won't get credit for like the steps that I'm taking. It's probably a little crazy, <laughs> but I won't always have it charged. Then I have two packets of emergency. This stuff is the best for boosting your immune system. If you feel like you have something like knocking it out this morning, Nate woke up, my husband, and said he felt like he had a sore throat. And I, I like, it's like a five alarm fire. Like we are not getting sick. <laughs> I'm pulling out all the stops. So I also have cold calm. I like to carry this with me anyway. Like if you ever feel a sore throat coming on, you pop some of these homeopathic tablets like right away and you can knock it out. And is that what else? I have eye drops. These are for my contacts. Sometimes in this like dry California weather, my contacts act up. And I have a single cough drop. Cause you never know when somebody's gonna have a coughing fit and you wanna be able to help them. And these are the things I think of when I'm packing my purse. I have my keys little Louis Vuitton key pouch. I adore this thing so much. The button is trash, which really breaks my heart. These colored buttons just don't hold up well at all. I really would like to trade it for a brass button, but it keeps my keys really nice and organized. It has the pink interior as well. So this is honestly one of my favorite designer things that I own, and it's probably the cheapest. What else? All right, so we're, we're filling out a little bit. This is a little pouch I use for my lipsticks when I'm on the go. And it's perfect, obviously, because it's gold lip shaped. And I put this keychain on it of a lipstick. <laughs> so it's like, hmm, I wonder what's in here. It's lip stuff. This keychain was from Ulta, and this pouch is by Wander Beauty. I got it with like a lip set at Sephora, I think. So normally this just has lip products, but when I do go out for the evening, I don't bring my whole wallet. Oh, it's in the other room. Well, if you've seen my other videos, you know I use an actual like medium-sized agenda as a wallet. I'll link one of those videos. I love that system, but I will admit when I'm going out using a smaller purse, like that's not gonna fit in here. So what I do is just bring what I'll need for the night. So I just have cash, my driver's license, and like a debit card for emergencies. And that's it. So I put those in my lip pouch and I just use it like a wallet plus lip pouch, obviously. <laughs> So what products do I have? I have the CO Bigelow Mintha Lip Shine. This is also from Bath and Body Works. I think it was the first lip gloss I ever used, like when I was like a kid. And I've rediscovered it. It's so minty, like it immediately, it honestly freshens your breath as a lip gloss. That's kind of weird, but awesome. And it, as you speak, I think it makes your breath smell good because your breath is like blowing past the lip gloss. I know that's weird, <laughs> but it just, it makes your breath minty fresh and it feels like tingly and nice and it's a very high shine. So I don't know, I randomly started liking that lip gloss from teenagehood again. And then I showed this before. This is a little set I got by It Cosmetics and it's a, it's their like, it's called Your Perfect Pink. It's the Je Ne Sais Quoi line and it's basically a white lipstick. But what's really weird is when you put it on, it adjusts to your skin chemistry or whatever the heck. It doesn't really swatch well because whatever happens, happens like on your lips and it just reacts and it turns the perfect pink. It's so weird. I love it though. And it's hydrating, which is nice because I really don't like a dry lip feeling. You can't really see where I swatched it. I'll, I'll show it on my lips another time, but it also has like this lip serum with it. That's kind of like a lip gloss, I would say. And then the last thing in here, are Listerine Cool Strips. I think these are like the best for freshening your breath on the go because you don't get that like sugary candy mint flavor afterward. All right, so then I do have just a couple of loose things at the bottom of this first, so let's see what we have. We have one Andes. Andes are like, oops, that was upside down. <laughs> Andes are probably one of my favorite treats. They're just like those little chocolate mints. And I like to have one after a meal because it like feels kind of decadent because it's chocolatey, but then the mint makes it like a finale and you don't really crave more sweets afterward, I feel like. Then I have these two adorable little containers. One says, please take a break. And one says, welcome to our kitchen. They're from Daiso, the Japanese dollar store, which has such adorable stuff. I love the pink and the blue. And I don't even really know what these phrases are supposed to mean in the context of like, pill containers or whatever they are, but I just really love them. I love the little phrases on everything at Daiso, it's so cute. But what I have in here are some vitamins. Do I have the whole jar? I don't have the whole jar in here, but it's called Wellness Formula and it is the best for knocking out a cold before it knocks you out. Like, I swear by it. Let me sit up. Um, 
It's like a, a mix of everything that could possibly boost your immune system and it knocks it out. And like I said, I'm not taking any chances today because Nate said he wasn't feeling great. So I have two little doses of it. It's like you take six pills at a time. Like it's serious. It's a, it's a hardcore supplement vitamin. Um, so I'm going to take two doses with us when we go out tonight in case his sore throat persists. All right, so now we're down to this little inner pocket, which I probably should have started with because these are my like most needed items other than my phone. And I like to just keep them in this pocket even though it doesn't really close because I just like to easily go straight to these things. So the first thing is a tissue. I do not leave the house without tissues. I don't know if that's like an allergy thing. Then I have this container of lotion. This is just like a reusable travel container and I refill it myself out of my huge, huge bottle of Deborah Lippman hand lotion because it's my favorite hand lotion ever. And it's not cheap. So I save a little money by getting the big one and like decanting it into this little thing and I refill it every week. And it is the best hand cream. I think I have a whole video on it because <laughs> it smells so good. It's so like hydrating for your hands and it has SPF in it. All right, next is probably my favorite most ride or die lip gloss, Fenty, of course. I mean, of course, everybody loves this. It's the Fenty Glow one and I just think it's like such a universally flattering shade it's so pretty and if I don't have anything else on my lips I will just always all day swatch this on it's hydrating it's not sticky it smells good and I just think it looks I should be careful not to smear that everywhere I just think it looks good with everything and I have two more lip products so small purse big amount of lip products that's just how I roll the other thing I have is my ride or die lip balm this is the Agave Lip Balm by Bite Beauty, and it is a savior for chapped lips. I mean, life-changingly good for chapped lips. And the last thing I have is a lipstick. This one is Charlotte Tilbury. It's so pretty. It's what I have on now. And it is the Kim KW shade. And it's a very, very pale pink. You can see it's super pretty. I have it on, but now it's like layered under all the other products I've tried. But this is a great one. I really like Charlotte Tilbury lipsticks. They're so pretty too. Look, and it matches my purse. <laughs> so that is everything. It's like, are you proud of me? Like that's significantly less than I normally would carry. So travel on light tonight. And I just wanted you guys to see how I roll when I travel light. I'll be in this beauty. This was a Christmas gift from my sister-in-law Tess, by the way. So thank you, Tess. And thank you guys for watching. If you're new here, I would love it if you want to stick around, hit subscribe. I do beauty, planning, organizing, just getting your life together. <laughs> we talk about all that stuff on this channel and more. And I like to talk to you guys in the comments down below. So I will say hi and get to know you guys a little more. Don't forget to hit subscribe. I have new videos every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. And that's it. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.